Imagine, if you will, yourself in a fine drinking establishment of which there is a real ale available, or Prosecco, or, or whatever your drink is. There, and then out in the garden there, the sun is shining, much like today. It is a beautiful, sunshiny end of April day. There's a little live music over there. Oh, let's have a listen. Why don't we sit down and drink that beer and have a listen to some music? the sunshine not locked inside no 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 we're outside in the sunshine mm. I might have to sit in the shade in a little while I think it's getting a little bit too hot <laughs> I miss Sunday session Sunday's a busy day for me I'm always playing somewhere on a Sunday afternoon uh, there's a lot of old town Hastings pubs I play in but all over the country and, and over in Europe as well and uh, Sundays are a good day for me acoustic kind of music works on a Sunday a good drink and uh, we're hung for a, a very reasonable hour in time for Monday morning. And I'll tell you this, the, uh, when you go out on a Sunday, the dickhead count is really low. I don't know why, maybe they've done it all on Saturday night, I don't know. Anyway, let's play some music, shall we? <laughs> uh.
off the moon, out there in the sunshine, enjoying each other's company, drinking a really good beer, just at the right temperature, and the, the chips, they, they just taste great, man. Oh, man. And it's the best Sunday roast I've ever smoked. I'm definitely having one of those later on after the show. Slim live at three every day, except Mondays. Everyone has to have a day off, so Monday's a day off. <laughs> Glad day off. Oh. So what can I tell you about on this fine sunny Sunday afternoon? Well, I can remind you about Isolation Station Hastings. That's uh, there on Facebook. That's uh, well, if you live in Hastings, that is. Please. Uh, they are a community group doing all kinds of really good stuff. They've got some TV stuff going on on Facebook, and some of it's really good. You know, well, actually, all of it's really good. Uh, but uh, on their website and their page, you'll find out about uh, what Giles Dooley is doing in, in Hastings, or is involved in doing, which I believe is called Hastings Helps the uh, NHS. So they're doing simple stuff for their local pe local uh, workers for the NHS. They're, they're doing things like arranging shopping for them and uh, arranging places they can isolate if they need to and uh, arranging free taxis for them whenever they need and all this kind of stuff. If you think you can help them, get in touch with those guys. So that's Isolation Station Hastings and then through them I think it's called Hastings Helps the NHS. Okay, should we play a bit more music? Um, I had a request to do um, a, a ballad that I wrote a few years ago. So I'm going to play it.
I can see the likes and the hearts going up the side of the screen. It makes a lot of difference. It really does. Excuse me for a moment. Mm -hmm. Some of you may have noticed we've got new tech involved today. I, I tried it out yesterday, uh, a couple of days ago, and I think it works okay. Uh, let me know how it's going. I think you can see big white screen now, not just in Portugal. I think it sounds okay. It looks all right. Let me know what you think in the comments, and that'd be really cool. Oh, well, what we're talking about in the comments. don't have to come around here, we can't, don't have to meet in a bar or anything like that. It's a bit clandestine, but I think we can get away with it. If you go to kingsizelim.com, simple as that, kingsizelim.com, three words, kingsizelim.com, go there, on the front page, just underneath the video, face like this, just underneath there is a button, it says, want to buy me a beer? If you press that button, you can buy me a beer, and I'd really appreciate that. What we've arranged is, we have a, a tap here, it's a pipe that comes from the old town, pumped straight up the hill. We'll be able to... No, no, that's a lie. I'm not. We'd wonderful if we could. One day we'll be able to do that. Ah, okay. Oh, I know what I was going to tell you. Uh, I'm just going to put the guitar down for a second. Let me show you something that I'm doing. Uh, as far as recording this goes, I'm working with a fella, a good friend of mine, Mi amico Gianni, over in Italy, my friend Gianni. Hi, Gianni. Uh, and we are bouncing tracks backwards and forwards. Gianni does a thing called The Blues Against Youth. Uh, it's a, I think it's, he describes it as like a blues punk experiment. It's brilliant. I nearly, nearly swore. It's really great. He's a very powerful performer. I had the privilege of working with him down at the Jelly Lind uh, not so long ago. And we hung out and we got really well. So we're bouncing a track backwards and forwards. And I thought I'd break all the rules and play a little bit of this. That's funky, right? That is funky. I like that. That's really funky. So, um, oh yeah. So we're going to do more of this in a few episodes of this uh, live at the three. I'll tell you what we're going to stick a video on YouTube about making the do, how we do it, all that kind of stuff. Sinus said, up some batteries in the oven. Batteries are about a few minutes away. I'm going to try and do that. If you can't focus on the real song.